So are we going now? Or yeah, can I carry them as my file? The guacamole land. So they'll hopefully all look pretty. Teach a lot. Yeah. Teach a loaf! All right, what up everybody? Hope you guys are doing well. Today, we are just going for a little bit of a vlog trip to Camaraz in Rosebank. They are having a show called SAS at Camaraz. It's the show. It is basically, it says the studio analog show. So it's all like old analog cameras and film and lenses and stuff. We're just gonna go have a look. I did buy this recently. <laughs> this past week, I don't know if you saw it on the vlog, but I bought this one. <clears throat> Let me get rabbit. This one, this is a... Uh, Minolta XG1. Now I haven't even used the film finish that, that it came with, so I'm not gonna say I know what I'm doing. But I'm gonna go. I'm gonna finish this roll of film today, maybe on somewhere on the side of the road with Michelle. And then uh, check it out, see if I've messed up, see if I'm half decent at film. Anyway, we're just gonna take you on a vlog, we're gonna pick up Kahara, go look around cameras, and then go to lunch. So that's the day. If you wanna stick around, we would love to have you, but otherwise I'll see you in the next one, but don't leave. I was kidding. Don't go. Even if you don't want to watch it, watch the video. Um, and if you have a minute, just scroll down a little bit, click that like button, and then come back up and watch the video. Okay. See you later. And then we are going to food. I'm actually pretty hungry. Me too. But did you feed your cranky? Anyways, we're gonna just wait for Kara to come out. I don't know how hungover she is from her birthday party last night, but we will find out. Was and the then in her defense. she says she was drunk, but it wasn't so bad. I tried to make a like this GoPro mount for um, what well, for GoPro, and I tried to make a mount for the Osmo because I don't have a GoPro anymore. And we're going to try film time lapses and some stuff on this while we're driving. Seems to be working pretty well, but uh, I'll let you guys know. Well, obviously you've seen the footage, so. Look at that eye tracking through sunglasses, dog. Well done. How well does it done, even see camera. It? Good camera. <laughs> What's up? Hello, sorry I couldn't find my mask. How are you feeling today? I'm okay. Mm. You're okay. How drunk were you? Um, quite drunk. Because you drank a lot before we even left, so... Like, I mean, that's a lot for me. I don't know what if that's a lot for people, or that's kind of crap for 21st. <laughs> Thank you. 
you want to check out the next one, cameras, we'll post them on Instagram. So follow them there and uh, come check it out. It's quite cool. The people here are very insightful and helpful. And uh, they taught me a little bit about what I need to do for film because I have no idea. And uh, yeah, come have some fun. Check out some prints. Check out some cheap, well not cheap, but affordable film cameras. And get into trying it out. So I'm going to try mine out this week. See, I found some really good cheap films for 25 bucks a roll of film. And uh, I'm going to practice with that. And then I bought some Portra 400, which I'm going to try with some more serious portraits and... Um, dance photos you guys can check that out on my main channel i think i'm gonna go find michelle now at the bookshop and then we're gonna go to lunch uh, we're, and then we'll finish off this uh, vlog after an eventful stop on the side of the road fixing a tire we are oh sh we are gonna get food food time yeah so I'll show you some B-roll, I don't know if we're going to talk much, but B-roll. We just fixed a tire that, that, I, so that I caused. Road. Okay, in my defense, I couldn't avoid it. <laughs> I was just there for more support. <laughs> <laughs> Bite to the tubes. Bite the tubes. Bite tubes. You better fing grind. Don't beat me up. Ow. Uh, again. Defensive bracelets. Today was the, it was called the Studio Analog Show mm -hmm. at Cameras, which is pretty much all analog cameras. And there was a guy there telling you how to do some stuff, and they were selling some cameras. And they all came with warranties, which was quite cool. I bought this earlier this week from another guy. So if you saw that vlog, you obviously know where I got this from. This is a Minolta XG1. And then I picked up some really cheap film that they make. Uh, they re-roll. Is that the word? Re-roll. Yes. So they re-rolled the old film canisters and then they sell them back like really cheap. 25 bucks a roll. So I got a bunch of that to test. And then I picked up some of this stuff. Kodak Professional T-Max 400. So that's black and white film. And then this is called... This is called... Portra 5, 400, I think. Yeah, Portra 400. So this one's very expensive. And um, I'm going to save that one for when I know what I'm doing. Because right now I don't know much. But I just, it's quite fun to play with. I just don't know if I'm messing it up. Um, we're going to learn how to scan them into the computer so that I can kind of light them a little bit and then share them with you guys. But I'm quite excited. We will be doing a shoot this week with this one. I'll let you guys know how this goes. Thanks for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to buy any of the gear I use, links below. Other than that, I'll see you later. So bye to the YouTubes. Bye. 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 You can follow Michelle's YouTube too. Yeah. It'll it'll get more busy when she when she doesn't have a full-time job anymore. Mm -hmm. See you later. Bye.